Stampers is Gigi with Stamp Fanatics, and today I have this really cute card for you. It says, Cocktails, because adulting is hard, and sometimes it just is. We need a little town time and, you know, just have a little something cold to drink. Um, our stamp set today we're using is Nothing's Better Than, and it's actually a bundle. It comes with these great dies that says coffee and cookies and cocktails and chocolate, and it also has some of the cute little cutouts, which are those. If you can see here, we have cookies, we have cocktails, we have chocolate, and we have coffee. All four are covered in this one set, and then just really cute sayings. So that's what we're gonna be using today. And I'm gonna start with Coastal Cabana, and I cut this already at five and a half by eight and a half, scored it at four and a quarter. And then the designer paper I'm using is Playing With Patterns. And I've shown you this before, but I'll just kind of thumb through it again of all the cute patterns. There's dots, there's stripes, there's just all these different, look at this, isn't that beautiful? And colorful, some of my favorite colors are in here. So we're gonna be using one piece of that, and I've cut this down to three and a quarter, so I just took off an inch, which is a half on each side, and still made it by five and a half. So we can go ahead and put that on, and I'm gonna use some liquid Tombow glue just to add this onto my card. Kind of got a lot there. And let's go ahead and put that on. And what I like about the Tombow glue is it gives me a little wiggle room and time to make sure everything lines up the way I want it. Once I have it straight, I can really push it down and then we're good to go. Okay, and then I have a piece of two inch by five and a half, Whisper White. And that's what we're gonna do our um, stamping on today. But before we do that, I wanted to show you, I took the cocktails die and I cut it out and so it looks like this and then I'm just going to punch that out carefully and it just pops right out and once I have that out if you notice I am not taking out the dot on cocktails I'm going to wait on that here we go okay and if you have any little pieces that stick in here, you can just take your paper piercer and cut them out. So what I wanna do is I'm gonna wait on this little dot. I don't wanna lose it, so I'm just gonna hold it to the side and I'll punch it out as I wanna use it. So that way you won't lose it. Okay, but what I wanted to do first was I just wanted to see where I want that situated on my card. And then I'm gonna take my Memento ink, and this is a black. I'm going to take my drink, a little cocktail, and now I know where to line it up. So I'm just going to do one there, and then I'm going to do one down at the bottom on the opposite side. And then I can take my same and stamp that right in the middle, like that. So that just helps me line it up. And now we can go ahead and adhere this too to our card. So I'm gonna bring in my silicone mat. I'm gonna take my liquid glue and just make a little bunch right there. I have one of our sponges that I've cut into quarters and I'm just gonna dab that and just dab it on the back of my word cocktails. And then I'm just gonna put it across. So let me get it on there so I don't get any glue anywhere. And just glue that down. And now I'm ready for that little dot that goes over our eyes. So I'm gonna go ahead and punch that out, flip it over. I'm just gonna keep it right on my finger there. Put a little glue on it. And then I'm just gonna flip it back and put it right on my card. Oh, hang on a minute. There we go. And just stick it right there. See that? Okay, so now we're ready to color. Now let me tell you what I'm using for my coloring. I'm going to be using the Coastal Cabana ink. And this is a two-step stamping set. So I have this interior of our cocktails that has some little ice cubes. And I'm just gonna go ahead and make this a blue drink. Let's 
So let me make sure I've got it all. And we'll just put that there. And there. There we go. And then for the umbrellas, I'm using three different things here. I'm using my Light Daffodil Delight, the Light Granny Apple Green, and the Light uh, Calypso Coral. And these are our blend markers. They're alcohol-based, and so they dry really quickly. So I'm going to make this one a lemon. So I'll just go ahead and color that in. And the other one, I'm going to make a lime. Let's get this up here on the camera. And this set is so adorable. I mean, who doesn't like chocolate? Who doesn't like coffee and cocktails? I mean, it's adorable. And the chocolate chip cookies are yummy. Okay, and then for my umbrella, I decided I was going to do this in the um, Calypso Coral because it just looks nice and bright and summery. And I just made both of my umbrellas the same color. Okay. And now we're ready to attach that to our card and I'm gonna add some Stampin' Dimensionals. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a couple there. Getting low on these. And then I like to use even the middle part, these ends, and when I have a long section, I just put that right on there like that. Let's go ahead and take this off. And we're almost done. And I have some real exciting news about an offer Stampin' Up! is doing. Our bonus days are back. And if you haven't participated in them before, they are so fun. Let me get this finished here and adhere to where I want it. I think that looks pretty good. And then we can go ahead and press down. But before I get done, I want to also add a few of these cute playing with patterns resin dots. They're so colorful and they match the paper beautifully. So I'm gonna take, let's see, one of these yellow ones, put it maybe right there. And then I took one of the purple posies and put it down there. And I have one more, let's use this Coastal Cabana color, and we'll put it right there. So isn't that cute? It just matches all the dots and everything on there. All right, and here's what I was telling you about. Here's the bonus days. For every $50 that you order or spend in our shop for July, you will earn a $5 um, gift card, I guess, not a gift card, I guess it's just a, a coupon, a coupon, like a rebate coupon in your email and that you can use when you purchase things in August. So you get to spend in July and then earn it to spend the coupons in August. And they come in your email, so be sure not to delete it, okay? Because that's the only way you're ever going to have it. And I don't know that Stampin' Up! can even keep going back and looking for, um, those codes. So if you need to take a snapshot, a screenshot, print it out, whatever you need to do, but don't lose those emails. And the good news about that is this set is on page 91 of our new catalog and it has a bundle. So for the stamp sets and the dies that I just showed you, you can save 10% at the same time while earning that extra $5 coupon for next month. And it's $46.75. So you're not just at 50 yet, but if you add these little resin dots or some other supplies that you need, some cardstock or something, you're there. So take advantage of that. So that's our card for today, and I hope you enjoyed it. I'll bring them both out for you. And if you need these supplies, please shop with me at stampfanatics.com and use this host code, and I'll send you out a special thank you. And thanks for joining me today. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. And um, if you haven't subscribed to my newsletter, please do. Um, just go to stampfanatics.com and click signing up for the newsletter and you will see all of these specials and any type of um, rewards or anything that we're giving out. You'll be reading about them. I give you card ideas, more card ideas. You'll see more of this stamp set on the newsletter. So go ahead and sign up. And thanks and have a great day.